Hi, I'm Coy Jondro here with Red Carpet Report, and I'm on the set of Runaways Season 2 with the entire enormous ensemble cast and the producers to talk about everything that's to come on December 21st. And, oh, I'm excited. The Aya Makamoto is a backdrop now. Oh, so. okay. Oh, oh. See, I like that. Yeah. Woo. A little, little nudge in the Marvel direction. Yeah. I'm not yeah. biased at all with my phone case. I'm just saying. <laughs> So actually, uh, it's a good start for me. Ryan yeah. was saying, next to Ryan being the sweatiest of the nerds on the set, you <laughs> were right there, number two. I'm pretty nerdy too, yes, I am. <laughs> Although I got to say, I grew up in Japan. Okay. So the bulk of my sort of comic universe is actually Japanese stuff. Oh, interesting. But I love Marvel stuff too. Yeah. Like I, I geek out with Ryan on set all the time. And the architect's got to be similar, like the yeah, yeah. compasses and all yeah, those things. Totally, so this is second totally. nature. And, the, and, the, and the also what's, what's great about Marvel comics and Japanese comics too is is the is the layered nature of yeah. the characters. You know, there's there's like so much going on. It's just not just two dimensional. Right. No, it is a two dimensional comic. Book, yeah, absolutely. You know? And that's the whole point. Is you get a fun, exactly. and that's why you guys are making a show out of the layers. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Runaways has way more layers when you give it time to breathe. Like oh, twelve dude. hours. Dude, and we I know, and we did. You know, we did that in season one, and like season two, dude, it pays off. Oh, I can't wait, man. I love it's, the pace of season one, so I can't wait for the. The, it the is lightning crazy. Destroy. It's going to, yeah, it is that. It is exactly that, man. Yeah. Look, I, 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 I'm, like, yeah, I'm, I'm re- see, see that? See, I, this, see, I, this, see the Goosebumps? I'm a Vaughn fan. I know you what's know? coming. <laughs> the last episode ends with a book takes off, yeah. practically. I mean, mm-hmm. effectively, now they've run away. Yes. And the way the books go is so next level uh-huh. that it's only up from here. Yeah. So exactly. knowing that as a comic fan, knowing the shape of comics, uh-huh. escalation in your nature, yeah. what was it like coming back to season two? It was, it was, well, well I mean, you know, like, Something something big is going to happen, and what what's been amazing about this season is, I it's one big thing after yeah. another after another. It's just it, it's relentless. It's relentless in, in 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 what happens in terms of the story. It's relentless in what happens what the what the characters are confronted by. You know, um, yeah. and and where the, the you know the the narrative goes and everything. And like this guy, this guy, he's, <laughs> he's relentless. He's relentless, relentless with all his interviews, man. You just keep like, coming back from yeah. He's got well, more to the say. Thing is is that Robert is a great dancer. A lot of people don't know. <laughs> Spoiler. So uh, he's going to give you some moves right now. I thought okay. he was coming in to say why the York <laughs> families no, are superior. He was just like, by the way, the real pride leaders are behind the scenes season two. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do not want to come back. This season, no, no. <laughs> well, that's the amazing thing with this cast. Is it is. Everyone's stopping each other in the hallway. They're Dude, taking pictures. There's such a bond. Yeah. And I don't think an ensemble works without that, especially in a uh-huh. show like this where it's you're dealing with drama but also fistagons. Yeah, like yeah. You're yeah, dealing yeah, with exactly. like, there's so yes, much happening. Yes, totally. And we were talking about how you ground everything in reality. Uh-huh. Your characters are science. Scientists and yes. intelligence is kind of the superpower, yes. which is a great theme Marvel does. Uh-huh. Downey Jr., Tom Holland, yeah, like everyone's got right. that thing. That's right. When you took this part, was that a, a strength for you? Is that something you wanted to lean into? Was that something that what, what drew you to the script? Well, it was. It, it was. I mean, what drew me to the script is Marvel. I mean, I mean, come on. <laughs> Although <laughs> oh, interesting, there. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Interesting that they're so secretive, though. Like yeah. I actually didn't know. Yeah. All I knew was that it was a untitled Hulu show. Yeah, you get like Star Wars sides or and something. And then yeah. I found out I booked it and it was a Marvel oh, show. I mean, dude. forget about it. I can't imagine that. Oh, oh it was just, just amazing. Amazing. Yeah, the wool off the eyes and there's that, a Marvel logo. Like, ah! <laughs> yeah. The, um, but like, that, you know, the, the, the thing about the science and the, and, and the tech and stuff is, it, you know, the it's, uh, what do you lean into? It's It's been awesome uh, this season that like, I feel like, there's more of that we spend time on on that and those elements right. for Robert too. Yeah. Of like so, you know, we we understand that Robert's sort of like the guy behind the scenes with you know with YZ Tech and like he's like this great tech genius mm-hmm. and was able to like you know come up with great ideas and you know. Um, but in season one, it was more sort of emotionally driven, right? Yeah. With the relationships and the the, the affair and the, the guilt the and dealing with and the, the yeah, yeah all that stuff. Dad dealing. Yeah. yeah. And now though, what's cool is that you know we you find out. You know, at the end of, of season one, you know, Jonah's killed, you know, my, my daughter, right? And so, like, I'm a man on a mission. Right. So, what do I, what, what do I go to? Right. Yeah. I go to my strength, you know? And so, and that's so the tech stuff. The science, and that's the, you, exactly. You can control that. Yes, so, as a control. Exactly. Ah, makes sense. And, like you know, that. and so, it's, it's, it's really, it's fun. It's, yeah. And, and it's, for this season, for Robert, I think, you know, hopefully the fans will, will really enjoy the different colors that come out, the, the, you didn't see. Right, you know, right. And in, the, the in, show in allows more one. of the parents to get a time to shine. Yes, you can, I think you can so. You that out a little yeah. bit more. Yeah, because like now, you know, it's like it, now that the kids have run away, 
you know, you have story. exactly you have the kid story and then you have the adult story, mm-hmm. you know, and then they intersect here and there and whatever. And it's still the overarching story is, of course, you know, for the kids, it's like, you know, to stay away and then ultimately get back at us. And then for the for the adults, is of course, to bring the kids back. You right. Know? Right. But it's it's so it's it's brilliant. I mean, the way that, you know, Josh and Stephanie and Quentin have like crafted the the, the narrative. It's is, big. It's is a lot of moving really pieces. really wonderful. I can't imagine the show Bible it being like no. you know, just the amount of stuff going on <laughs> it's, throughout it's, all it's, filming. It's like, just, yeah. And a dinosaur. Yeah, but like, <laughs> like at the end of the day and Marvel show and here's some stuff. Like that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. So as a comic fan, is there anything that you've gotten back into being in the comic world? Has this oh, brought you man. back into like – do you go to a comic store now? Have you, you like brought back into the world? Or? It's – well, it, I don't know. Yeah. What's crazy is that, like, you know, it's, it's it, the blessing of working is that you're like busy, right? Yeah. You got all kinds of stuff. But, like, what's what I'm actually looking forward to, and something as a comic fan I, not, I never really did was the Comic Con. Oh, yeah, man. It's amazing. So, I'm, yeah. So, I'm kind of looking forward to like joining that world or like, you know, to seeing what that's like yeah. from the other side. You guys are going to New York, you know? right? Like, there's going to be, yeah, yeah. We're going to New York. I mean, and, you know, there'll be other stuff around and yeah. around throughout the year and everything. Oh, you'll so love that, it. I think that would be a cool thing to see. Seeing explore. comics from, like, that perspective. Yeah, yeah. Like, what? Yeah, yeah. And you're a piece of, like, this giant show? That it's is so that. Weird. Yeah, it is. It is. It's strange. Dude. Yeah. It's totally strange to be on the other side. Yeah. And going, like, what? how did, how did this happen? <laughs> this is you me know? on this oh, side. Oh, God. okay. You know? Yeah. yeah. So, final question for you. Yeah. In the world of comic books, what do you think your character would enjoy? Movie, comic? Like, if you had time to read. He's a scientist. Oh. So. Oh, yeah. Deep cut question. Oh, that is a good, good question. I think, I think Robert is uh, a classics guy. Mm-hmm. I think it would be Adam. Ah, all right. Tetsuo Atoma. Yeah. I think that's probably his his read. I, you know? Know, so I, I gave him a Doctor Strange flavor because I thought it would be oh, escapism for him while uh-huh, leaning into science. Uh-huh. That was, I was watching him and I've tried to piece together all those okay, things. Okay, yeah. I like that. Now yeah. it gives me something to dive into. It's, I think so. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, you know. Right? Yeah. Uh, well, congratulations. I'm Thank really you. excited for season two. Thank and you very enjoy much. enjoy the Comic-Con experience and all this yeah, madness. And it's good yeah, to I'm know someone that it. loves it is, is doing it. Yeah. Yeah, it's fantastic. Sure. Right, Th- December twenty first, December twenty first, Hulu binge. So I've been Koi Jandro. The cast is incredible. So many of them know and love comics. If you like this video, click like, subscribe for more, and hunt me down on Twitter at Koi Jandro. And thank you so much. I cannot wait for Runaways. Appreciate it.